think the best gig I've actually ever been to was probably Machine Head and Eving With on mm. the Catharsis tour. The best, most important gig I've ever been to was the first time Slipknot toured over a... Depeche Mode mm. uh, Olympic Stadium. Uh, there's, there's, there's a couple. I uh, saw Korn on the Issues tour in 2000 at, I can't remember if it was London Arena or Wembley Arena. There's two or three. One of them was the first time I saw Sepultura with that insane fucking drummer. <laughs> I saw Metallica in 2003 at Earl's Court on the St. Anger tour. Mm. I know people, that album didn't go down well with a lot of people, but um, you know, there was only about four or five songs played off that album. Mm. Um, and it was at my favourite venue, Birmingham Road 2. I still think the best sound. He's a mentalist. He's doing a lot of good mm. vids at the minute, so people are more sort of recognising who he is. He's just a monster and he hits so hard but he's so fast and he don't use triggers or anything and he, he's just so powerful but the stuff he plays is just unbelievable. First, it was my first time ever doing a stadium gig mm. uh, to see a band like Depeche Mode mm. as well. The atmosphere was just so casual. It was just something else. This was like Slipknot when they were still mysterious. This is like, this is when they were still this kind of mystical band and when you're that age, coming up when they were coming up it was like the, the atmosphere was ridiculous he's transformed them mm. to where we've always held them yeah, just because exactly. it's Sepultura a bit yeah, nostalgic but like he just put put them right right back up there oh an honourable mention has to go to Decapitated when we sat on that um, hard rock hard rock hell and we sat up on the balcony yes and just watched them yeah I've never seen it. that was unbelievable Unbelievable that was. So yeah, they're, they're well up there. Um, so, so casual. And then as the sun went down, and it got darker, and the hits came out, mm. then it just went on to like, full on, I can't even explain how fucking good it felt. Uh, probably my fondest gig I've ever been to was seeing Architects back in 2018 at Alexander's Palace. Just the sheer emotion of the show and the fact that all my mates were there and the camaraderie, it was such a special night. It was so cool to kind of share that experience with 10,000 other people. I mean, that's definitely one that will stay in my mind for a long time. The mosh pit was ridiculous. Like, I've, I'm, I'm not a tall guy. I've, I was just getting beaten up constantly, but I found myself in the middle of it. It was the Wolfram Hall. The Wolfram Hall. You could hear it every time I've seen him just because the just been so ridiculous like and when we played on the main stage we were lucky enough to uh, have a um, dressing room right next to theirs so it ended up meeting them and stuff and they actually treated us like human beings as if we should have been there but little did they know that I was a complete imposter <laughs> <laughs> so, you know some of the old incubus gigs at um, Rock City mm. when that yeah when they when, when they brought out science and make yourself and they used to come to Rock City um, yeah, they, they're some of the best, best gigs I've always done with them. Awesome. Yeah. Uh, it's when Sid jumped off, landed on a girl, which landed on my mate at the time, uh, and she got caught off to hospital and the council were trying to get her to press charges, but she wouldn't because obviously she's a fucking metalhead. 